Blessed guys, we're here once again, 24 hour kitchen, cooking with Ringo Vision. Today guys, I've got fish on the menu, I've got sea bass and I've got sea bream. I'll be frying fish for you guys today with a different type of flair, with a different type of style, yeah? Because I know everyone may be used to the, 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 the standard Caribbean escabeach fish with your, your onion and your vinegar and your pepper and you understand? But today we're going to give you a different style. You understand? Yeah. So look out for this one, guys. It's going to be coming out straight. I hope you like, comment, and subscribe, and share it with friends and family. When we say like, comment, and subscribe, and share it with friends and family. All right, this one's going to be a good one. Let's kick it, guys, yeah? All right, first of all, I want to tell you guys as well, yeah? My fish has been washed, clean, soaking in some lemon, if you check the previous episode, I've done fish before so you can see how I've cleaned my fish. If you check the previous epi episodes before as well, you can see how I've dealt with the vegetables. All vegetables are washed today already and some has also been prepped already as you can see like my, pun my pumpkin here. I've peeled my pumpkin and washed my pumpkin also as well. And one more thing I've got in my bowl as well. I've got my chocho here in my bowl. I've peeled it but I've not, I've not cut the heart out of it yet. So. It's going to be an exciting episode guys, so let's get cracking. First of all, yeah, I'm going to take the water off the fish and then get with the seasoning because you know it's that like fast tracking up. Yeah, so we'll do it. Sea bass, and as you can see, this one here is a sea bream. I'm gonna cut up one garlic that I've already peeled and, and shelled already to put in my oil while I'm frying my fish. Okay, so while the pan is getting, getting hot, I'm gonna put some oil in there. So you see how the frying pan I drink up the oil. Alright. Before I start seasoning my fish, I'm going to give my fish a slice. So I give him a middle slice. So with this slice here, I'm going to be able to get my seasoning lined up through, through the middle here, through the slit. So all of them is going to get a middle slice, yeah? So the sea bass, I sliced it like that. So now I'm gonna give the sea rim a slice, but I'm gonna give it a different slice. I'm gonna give it two slices. Alright, now, now that I've done my cutting, now I'm going to start with my seasoning. I'm just going to just base the belly with a tiny bit of salt. Cause you, you, you know fish, fish is a thing you know, it's just salt and pepper you need for fish, really and truly. You can use salt and pepper and, 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 the season, and season fish. It all depends on the flavour that you want to bring out. So I'm going to 
also do the same with the other fish as well also. And this one now is a bit of garlic, I'm just gonna, gonna flash it, you know. So I'm gonna use some, this is the next season with just some herbs, mixed herbs. I have my turmeric, Kirkland, turmeric, you know what I say, turmeric, them sitting here carry whole heap of different, different, different components for the body, will help out the body. All purpose seasoning. So I just rub all those seasonings and let them and they're all blending nice and evenly. Yeah, nice over there, sir. You see, quick and fast and magic. Quick rubbing. Nice over there, sir. Alright, have a look. Alright, I can smell my oil. So I right, we could just quickly wipe off back our surface. You know what I'm saying? We like the kitchen must always be cleansy people. Always be clean. So we clean as we go along, you see it? So I'm gonna, I'm gonna add my, my garlic. I'm gonna add my garlic to the oil. So let's, let's try out our first fish. Now I'm gonna um, sort out the veg for the fish. My oil's already hot, so I'm gonna put all my chopped up veg into my oil.
I'm gonna add a bit of all-purpose seasoning now. My next season that I told you guys about earlier, my herbs. Yeah, herbs. My Dunn's River all-purpose seasoning. Alright guys, we're at the final chapter right now. We've got our okra, pumpkin, chocho, all the ingredients that I showed you earlier on. So I'm now gonna spread this nice and lightly over the fish. So as you can see now, we're finished. We're at end. And this is our fish, fried fish, with a Ringo Vision special. Not your ordinary garnish with onions and peppers and carrots, with your vinegar. This one's a, a bit different with your pumpkin, your okra, your chocho, you know? It's all here, guys. And I hope you guys enjoyed this session. 24 hour kitchen, cooking with Ringo Vision. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. Stanley, how are it looking? It's looking lovely, mate. I can't wait to tuck in. Miss In and Out? It looks very colourful and lovely. Can't wait to eat. All right, thank you guys. And I hope to see you guys in the next episode with the next fantastic journey with Ringo Vision. Don't forget to like, comment and subscribe. You can find Ringo Vision on all major platforms which is Instagram, YouTube and also Snapchat and also TikTok. Thank you guys. See you soon.